Ever notice how most supercars don't have sunroofs? It's not because rich people hate sunshine, it's because physics hates sunroofs. First wait. Supercars fight for every single gram. Adding a sunroof means more glass, more motors, more frame support. That's extra weight, right at the top, which kills handling. Second structural integrity. Supercars are often carbon fiber monocoques. Cut a hole in that roof, you weaken the entire chassis. Not great when you're pulling two G's in a corner at 300 km per hour. Third aerodynamics. That flush roof line? It's not just pretty. It's slicing air at insane speeds. A sunroof messes with airflow, downforce, and noise. Bonus reason, nobody's cruising casually in a Ferrari at 40 km per hour thinking, let's open the sunroof. You want engine noise, not birdsong. So next time someone says, why no sunroof? Just tell them, because downforce is greater than daylight. Drop a sun emoji if you'd still want one. Like and follow for more car facts that break the mold.